Okay, so this is F log, and F log, there's no film simulation. <laughs> As a matter of fact, it's pretty flat. Now, I've heard that you're supposed to uh, crank it up a little bit, overexpose it by two thirds of a stop or a stop. And right now it is, it's at F 2.0, 1 48th of a second, and ISO 1000. Now, there's no way I can tell right now, but maybe later, maybe I can put the, the LUT in the small HD so it can give me a sense of what I'm doing. Uh, but right now it's an F log. Uh, and let me see. I'm going, I mean, it's, it's pretty balanced. My face is. And the small HD is exposed, it says it is. This part right here is blown out. This part is blown out right here, right there a little bit. That right here is blown out. Now, blowing out, does that mean I'll be able to recover it? I don't know. I'm definitely going to try to recover that. Uh, I don't know how to do anything like that with F-Log. Uh, is it going to look different when I um, used a lot? I have no idea. Uh, right now, uh, it's using an ND filter and a polarizer. I'm using the polarizer just to see if there's any difference. It gives me an extra few stops, maybe a stop more, a stop in a third. Uh, I have an ND, an ND filter that's three stops plus the polarizing filter that gives me four. I think they're additive. So that's why I'm at ISO um, 1000. F log apparently puts it at automatically at 8 so that you can pick up the shadows probably. But at the same time, I don't know about these things that are blown out. All right, I think we'll stop there.